So you've come to this video to fix your interior pelvic tilt. If you're someone that looks like this and you wanna fix it and look like this, that's what we're here for. Five gym exercises to focus on strengthening those muscle groups that are super weak. And next episode will be five stretching exercises. Let's jump right into it. Number one, you're gonna to wanna to focus on strengthening your glutes. This is super important. And you probably know this if you have anterior pelvic tilt, but it's really important you work them in a full range of motion. This is why I love hip thrust or any thrusting movement in general. You can do hip thrust, single leg hip thrust, glute pull throughs. We have a tutorial on all three, so I definitely recommend checking those out down below. But as you can see here, I'm putting the glute in its natural motion of extension and contraction, and that's really gonna help strengthen it and balance it out. The glute is a key postural muscle, and when you're sitting all day, you're not moving, you're gonna put it in this weird tilted position that's gonna push your butt up. So by strengthening it and working it in a full range of motion, it's gonna improve your posture, it's gonna improve your strength, and this is key. And before we jump into tip number two, just wanna give you a heads up. First link in the description, we have spent some good time to prepare a full workout routine, as well as a stretching routine to help you fix your anterior pelvic tilt. So make sure right now, pause the video, go download that. You will be saved because this will help you out if you follow it consistently. And number two, this exercise is the king of all exercise. Squat, but not just a squat, a deep squat, okay? So this is gonna be amazing. It's gonna help you just learn a really fundamental movement that we all need to know how to do properly and properly practicing it will help you down the road, okay? It's gonna be great for your quads, for your core, for your, um, for your glutes, all those all amazing exercises that need to be strengthened, okay? So one of the biggest things is I highly recommend, second link in the description, we have a full tutorial on how to properly squat, okay? So if you are someone that has the anterior pelvic tilt and you start to squat, and you're just curving your spine and you're kind of going like this, this is just gonna put a lot of strain on, but if you're actually walking through this specific exercise that we show you, you know, forcing yourself to keep that core tight, you know, a little bit of a forward lean, sitting back down nice and low, this is gonna help you a ton and I really, really recommend you adding this to your routine, but once again, it has to be done properly. Number three, this one isn't weighted, but it's really important and this is a great warm up to do. These are called bird dogs. As you can see, you're getting a lot of control between your arms and your legs. And most importantly, you're putting that hip through extension and contraction. You're also gonna really work on balancing and strengthening your core, which is gonna go a long way to rectify the anterior pelvic tilt. As I talked about earlier, by having a strong core and having a strong posterior chain, you're gonna have a strong base of support and you're gonna be able to stand up tall, have that glutes in nice and contraction and standing in a natural way. And next up, still on the topic of strengthening the core because this is one of the most important things to help you fix your anterior pelvic tilt. Keeping that core nice and tight, focusing on strengthening exercises is gonna be the side plank. Truthfully, any plank variation, as long as your core is nice and tight, your back is nice and flat, is gonna be huge. But the side plank is great because it's gonna kind of force you into that position. So as you can see on the screen there, um, essentially the core is nice and tight, Everything's in a straight line. There's no, you know, shoulders rolled forward. It's a fantastic exercise to help alleviate back pain, but also to help fix your anterior pelvic tilt. A very important one is gonna be a clamshell. So as you can see on the screen here, I'm actually not using a band, but if you do have access to one, it's gonna help with some resistance. It's gonna force your glute medius, which is that side glute, to work a little bit harder. And this exercise and this muscle group specifically is super important for helping your pelvis actually stabilize. It's very overlooked. We did actually just upload a great tutorial as well for the adductor and abductor machine which is another great thing to add into your routine but these clamshells are amazing right they're gonna help you balance the muscular effort between your inner and your outer thigh which is gonna help you just overall develop a nice strong lower body and especially that side glute so add these in these are amazing you can do them very consistently essentially every single day and they will help you out one small tip when doing this exercise a lot of people mess it up they think that they have to just be bringing their leg a bunch it's a very small range of motion, okay? Keeping everything nice and flat, just opening up, feeling the contraction in that outer glute. Great exercise, but it doesn't have to be a huge range of motion like most people think, just up and then down, okay? And just one last bonus exercise to give you a little bit extra. We've already strengthened the glutes and we've already strengthened the core. We've still gotta make sure that the hamstrings are being strengthened. So a lot of times people focus on just stretching the hamstrings and think that's gonna solve the problem, but that's definitely not true. So this is one of my favorite hamstring exercises. You can do this on a machine or a stability ball. For today's purpose, we're gonna use a stability ball. Basically just getting set up on the ground, getting your heels on here, and you're gonna lift up your torso. Once again, keep everything nice and flat. You've gotta squeeze your core, okay, to make sure that everything, your pelvis is not being pushed forward. You're gonna roll onto the top of your feet, and then onto the heels. Feet, heels, okay? Get some nice tension, 
This can once again be done on a machine if you have access to it, but this is a great additional exercise to really focus on strengthening the hamstrings. Just wanna say thank you so much for tuning into this video. We appreciate every single one of you. Hopefully this helps you a ton. And to give you an added bonus, make sure to click that first link in the description. There's a free full three page guide with a bunch of different exercises as well as a rep scheme and set scheme to help you fix that interior pelvic tilt so you don't have to suffer anymore. Download that if you do wanna take things to the next level. It's absolutely free. We appreciate you all. Thank you so much and we'll see you in the next video for the stretching exercises. Peace.